Hello, yes, the power of white nationalism. That's right. I'm sure you've all seen of late in the newspapers the Dalai Lama. Yes, the Dalai Lama, the man of peace, talking about immigration into Europe and that it must stop and be reversed and Europe must remain European and not become an African or Muslim continent. Now, if you didn't know who the Dalai Lama was, you'd have thought, those are the words of some white nationalists that used to write in John Tyndall's Spearhead magazine. But we all know who the Dalai Lama is and we know that he's not a white nationalist that used to write in John Tyndall's Spearhead magazine. Let alone what our enemies would deem a racist. He's a man of peace. Yet his words are something from uh, the pages of Spearhead magazine, aren't they? Of course they are. Vladimir Putin, though he's never out the newspapers anyway, he's been in the newspapers of late condemning uh, immigration and liberalism and what it's done to the West and that it's had its day and it has had its day. And you know why? Because it's our day now, right? It's had its day now. Vladimir Putin is not a white nationalist, maybe a Russian nationalist, but he's not a white nationalist, let alone a racist. Then we come to Donald Trump, who most certainly isn't a white nationalist, let alone a racist. Yet, he can still see the threat posed by a million mestidos pouring over the border into America every year. So he's building a wall to keep them out, right? Because common sense prevails. That's what's happening with all these great people. Common sense is prevailing, right? The Dalai Lama, Vladimir Putin, Donald Trump, and there's going to be many, many more joining the chorus in their condemnation of mass immigration into the West and liberalism that's destroyed it from within. But like I keep saying, right, it's our day now. It's our time now. No matter how hopeless it seems, it's not this. When it does turn around, it will be overnight, trust me, because there will be more people now. They'll be getting more, they'll be getting confidence and they'll be encouraged when you've got the man of peace, the Dalai Lama. Christ, come on. You can't get anyone with better credentials than the Dalai Lama, right? What are they going to call him? Have they called him a racist or Nazi yet? It's a wonder, right? So there's going to be more people coming forward. They're going to put their heads above the parapet and they're going to now start speaking out. And like I've said, when this change, there'll be no stopping it. And we've got to be ready for when it does. And we're going to be ready. Trust me, we are. I have never been so enthusiastic and happy in all my life than I am now because I can see the tide is turning and the sooner the better. Okay, thank you.